Welcome back to Pseudo Sergeant. Last time I introduced you a few different distributions. This time we're going to install an operating system onto the Raspberry Pi utilizing the Noobs installer. In order to utilize the Noobs installer, first we have to download it. So I navigate on over to the raspberrypi.org downloads Noobs. There's the Noobs offline installer and the Noobs light installer, which installs over the network. So I installed that. I have it in my directory here. So here is the zip file and here it is extracted. So I take these files and over here, this is my SD card, the removable drive here. I take these files, I just drag them and drop them. I copy them onto the SD card, see what happens. Now that I have the files onto the SD card, I'll take the SD card, put it into the Raspberry Pi, connect the screen, the keyboard, and give it power and then continue with the install procedure. Now we've got the Raspberry Pi booted up and it's into the Noobs installer. And the installer gives us some options here. We have uh, install, edit config, Wi-Fi networks. We could actually connect to the local Wi-Fi network because this Raspberry Pi has a wireless adapter in it. We can get some online help and we can exit. But um, here is a list of operating systems that we have available to install. In this instance, I'm going to install Raspbian with the Pixel desktop environment, Raspbian with Pixel. So I'll go over here and I'll click on Raspbian with Pixel. Then I'll click the install. Warning, this will install the selected operating system. All existing data on the drive will be overwritten, including any OSs that are already installed. Not a big deal. Click yes. And the install process will begin to proceed. Oh, I'm actually, I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna select the language, English, US, and keyboard, US, that's cool. We'll see how long this takes. All right, that's done. Now let's see the results. Click OK. It's going to restart. Oh, welcome to Pixel, powered by Raspbian. Now that we have the operating system installed, we can go ahead and configure this to do whatever we want it to do. Install additional software, use the software that's on here, or you know what, if we were to configure it as a uh, retro gaming system, we could uh, do some retro gaming with it. So that's how we install Raspbian with the Noobs installer on the Raspberry Pi. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. And that's all the time we have for this segment of the Pseudo Sergeant. If you'd like to see more, please visit us at element14.com forward slash TBHS.